Thank you so much for joining me today. In today's video, we are going to review a new Wish product. This is Kosas Cloud Set. And uh, I'm really excited to see if this is as good as it promises. Because let me tell you, it promises a lot. So if you're interested in that, go ahead and keep on watching. If you're new here, my name is Cosmina. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. Please consider to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy it. What we do on this channel is usually we do a little bit of review. We have a little bit of fun with makeup from throughout the decades. Uh, so also we're doing some mystery box unboxing. So if any of that sounds interesting for you, please don't hesitate to subscribe to this channel. Now let's move on. So this is Kosa's Cloud Set Baked Setting and Smoothing Powder. It says it's a super smooth, no shine, all set. Uh, super, uh, it says it's an ultra soft, sheer setting and smoothing powder baked with skincare actives that helps minimize shine and the appearance of pores. Now I did all my makeup, but I have not set up my face. So I'm ready to set up my face with this and see how it feels. I know when I went into Sephora, I felt this and it is divine the way it feels. And that really intrigued me and I was like, I need to try that on my face and see if it's as it feels as amazing on the skin as it used to as it felt when I touch it right with my finger because uh, I would not put it on my uh, face in the store no okay so what I have I have the pillowy which this is says it's a sheer medium tan um, this is has 9.5 grams and it has 33 um, fluid ounces and this is how the packaging look like it's really beautiful a nice beautiful plastic one that says Kosas I have not tried anything from this brand so far so I have no idea how this brand it is and I have no idea of anything they had before I do know some people tried it and really really enjoy it so let's give it a go this is how it looks inside it definitely feels absolutely like nothing like very hydrating and buttery you know what i mean it just like disappears onto onto your fingers so i'm gonna take a big fluffy brush and i'm gonna take this one all over my face i did apply um a little bit of powder under my eyes because i needed to finish up my makeup but it does wait wow was trying to say uh, no nowhere else i haven't tried anything i haven't put anything else other than um a bronzer which is uh, this one which is soul uh face and body bronzer from colorpop or soul beauty so this is how it feels amazing it feels super super soft and it also feels like um, very little, very little, but a little bit of a cooling effect. It doesn't feel like a lot, but it feels extremely soft and beautiful. And I feel like it gives it a little bit of a glow to the skin. Don't you think the same? Like, I feel like that's what it does. Like, what I have underneath it for the base, for the foundation, it's a foundation, it's a combination of two foundations, but it doesn't need to be that much set but it looks absolutely beautiful Let's see. now i need a mirror to see if it really did um smooth up my pores and make them disappear okay so 
it looks really beautiful um i really do enjoy how this looks like it does look smoothing on the skin it looks absolutely beautiful on the skin now does it makes the pores disappear not really but they make them look just a tiny bit more smaller just a little bit but yeah this is this is how it looks like right now on my skin it looks a very nice and very beautiful and kind of has a little bit of a dewy effect a little bit of a luminosity it gives to my skin so it's kind of hard for me to believe that this is just gonna stay on my face by the way i do have an oily skin so this is gonna stay on my face all day without my oil showing up and like breaking through it it's hard for me to believe that but that's why we're gonna put it to a test and we'll see how long is my face is gonna look like this you know what i mean because this is look really beautiful but yeah that's that's what it says it, it says it's gonna it's gonna be smoothing and it's gonna help minimize shine and the appearance of pores we'll see about that i i will see about that if it's gonna change during the day and what how long is it gonna be looking beautiful on my skin it does look really beautiful right now but i cannot trust that this is gonna stay this way all day now i'm gonna go with a blush too because i haven't applied brush and this is the uh diffuse heat ambient light blush from um hourglass and i'm just gonna add a tiny bit over here oh it looks so beautiful on top of that powder that looks really nice now i'm gonna do a little bit of contouring on my nose that's it i don't want to do anything else so I'm going to take um, Too Faced Cocoa Contour and I'm going to take the medium contour and add this one a little bit, just kind of give a little bit of a different shape to my uh, nose because my nose, it is crooked. I don't know if you can uh, detect that, but it is. So I just want to make sure it looks a little bit more straight. It is a funny story how it got crooked, but I'm not going to share it today. But I am going to share it with you in a different time. Alright, so this is how everything looks so far. I do really enjoy it so far. It looks really pretty on the skin. And... Um, it's nice. It's nice. I I don't know. She would just like, like how, like look how it looks right now. It's beautiful, absolutely gorgeous on the skin. So I'm not sure if this is gonna stay the same. I wish it will, but we shall see. We shall see. All right. I'll see you in a few minutes with a uh, checking. Alright guys, so it's been about three hours since I had this on my face. I went shopping, so there's some missing on my nose. And this lighting is not necessarily the greatest. But this is how it looks right now. I am feeling sweaty. Like, I can feel... Because I had a mask on, so I've been sweating a little bit. But so far, I still like it. Um, I don't know. But you can see it. Like, you can see it on top of my face. You know what I mean? Like, you can see a little bit. There you go. I had this on for about 
six hours now and it looks makeup -y. it looks uh, it looks a little bit you know like you can see everything on my face now it's not looking as smooth as it used to and I went out I went shopping I did a lot of, I wore my mask for at least two three hours so this is how it looks right now um I still don't see necessarily my shine coming through just yet but I can tell you right now that the smoothness does not last for as long as I wish it would um, you can see that I'm sweating a little bit in this area but other than that it's still okay around the nose is not necessarily that amazing but I had my mask on so I cannot necessarily keep that against it but on my um, on on my face it, you can totally see it it's not as smooth as it used to look like I'll see you in a few hours okay so we are back it's been nine hours since I had this on and this is how it looks right now don't mind my dishwasher on the back but I it's just insane because I feel like now it looks better all of a sudden you know what I mean like now that a little bit of my oils are peeking through and showing through um, it looks a little bit better than what it used to look like earlier today when we checked in last time it looked very makeupy but now it definitely looks just a tiny bit better there's one thing though that i am surprised is that my shine didn't my oils didn't necessarily show up um during the day so that's a good thing but it did transform during the day of course the nose around the nose it doesn't look the greatest and around here uh this area it's not looking the greatest but um on this side it looks a little bit better than what it used to look like earlier today so what i would say about this powder this is more like a soft powder that is not necessarily it's going to transform a little bit during the day but i would not use this one if i would go to work because it changes so much um and i probably just use this one uh for like a quick uh makeup look for like a spring um summery time but not like a heavy duty powder right so just make sure you understand that but this is how it looks right now it looks much better than earlier it still looks a little bit like you know makeup -y here and there but it's it's better you know it looks a little bit better so there you have it this is my review for you today let me know if you are going to grab this or not or let me know if you liked it give this video a thumbs up and i will see you all next time